Yo, what's good, YouTube? It's your boy J So Real Man, and I'm back with another banger, man. Welcome back. Welcome back. So real gang. Check this out, man. I got a special video for y'all today, man. Today, I got an advanced dribble tutorial for y'all, man, in this new season four, man. A lot of people have been texting me, and they've been saying they're having a hard time doing their thing out here, man. So, I got y'all. I got y'all. I got y'all, man. So, today, I'm going to show y'all every single thing that I use, all my animation, all my saves. You feel what I'm saying? And then, I'm going to show y'all how to activate these animations, man, so you can be able to cook up at the park. You feel me? Because it ain't fun if you ain't cooking up. You feel what I'm saying? So, before we start off this whole entire video, man, do me one one favor man hit that subscribe button like the video and comment how you feel about this new season man because we on that grind of 5k and the grind don't stop you feel what i'm saying so let's go ahead and get into it man we're gonna first start off with the animations so let's go all right man we're gonna start off with the dribble style first man for the dribble style i went with quick uh, uh this is the one i've been using for so long but as y'all know bro as the seasons come on bro everything just changed bro so now i've been just rocking the shifty so make sure you go ahead and equ equip that uh shifty dribbling style moving on signature size up now i ain't gonna lie bro this is a new one i think that's in a new season bro but i've been using it out and i love it bro jeremy lynn bro i've been using jeremy lynn signature size up so make sure y'all go ahead and equip that one man and then we moving on gang signature combo man for my signature combo man i had to go with d wade man i did try d rose but i like d wade way more better bro way more better i feel like i get ankles off of this too bro when i got the ankle baker uh take on and i just been going crazy with it you feel what i'm saying so make sure y'all go ahead and equip that d wade signature combo and then moving on size up escape package man as y'all can see right now i'm rocking with trey young if you can't get trey young then you can try something other than uh trey young you use like d wade or something like that but i'll go with trey young you feel what i'm saying i still get kills off of this i still be getting off threes like this you feel what i'm saying this is what i'm rocking with man so make sure i go ahead and click that real quick man and moving on moving crossover man now the fastest one i think that that's in the game right now is the chris paul bro as you guys can see when you coming down court you do that little twin real quick you feel what i'm saying easy kills especially for when you coming down the court you want to just kill somebody and just throw it up you feel what i'm saying but that's my moving crossover man so moving on moving behind the back man now this is uh this is is kind of like a to each his own but i do these two right here man so i go back and forth between scotty pimpin and dame lillard but honestly i feel like dame lillard is kind of a little bit more better like i said to each his own with these two but i went with dame lillard man so make sure i cop either dame lillard or scotty pimpin man this honestly doesn't even matter the difference is it's a different behind the back with the scotty pimpin i feel like it's a longer behind the back like it take a long time to throw it behind the back when you're doing a standing one but then with the dame lillard one you get that little fast standing behind the back you feel what i'm saying so to each his own like i said y'all could try out both of them but this is what i'm rocking with is a dame lillard man moving on moving spin all right now check this out man now i always go with k leonard this is ain't never gonna change and i'm gonna tell y'all why is i do a lot of like you know what i mean like i'll do like a spin back to the three-point line you feel what i'm saying and this is what you gotta have on to be able to do that so make sure i equip this man this k leonard i'm gonna be showing y'all literally in a dribble tutorial what i mean about this k leonard man i feel like this is the best and fastest spin back you feel me in the game yeah. so make sure i go ahead and equip and move on moving hesitation man now this th these really don't even matter bro because i mean you can you can do a hezzy and it's just gonna be slow bro they all slow bro there is like no good one honestly if you ask me bro but for my moving hesitation man i went with john wall so make sure y'all go ahead and quit that john wall man moving on now this one right here man moving step back this is the one you want to be looking at you can use jay butler um another one you can use too is luka Doncic. i haven't used it on this player yet because i like the jay butler as you guys can see in the animation he do like a really fast step back and out of this step back you can speed boost out of it and i love using it it's been in the game ever since season one man and i've still been rocking with it like i said you can use this one or you can use luka Doncic. but for this sake of this video man just make sure you go ahead and equip that jay butler and then moving on all right gang before i give y'all this dribble tutorial man i just want to make sure y'all got on the right badges before i show y'all i gave y'all the sigs already man so now i'm finna just get y'all the badges man and i'm gonna let y'all know some about these badges man because i know a lot of people don't know bro you just don't know it's all good bro i got you i got you 
So check this out, man. The first badge that we're going to go with is Hyperdrive, man. This is increases the speed at which a player can perform more dribble moves as they attack down the court. Now, a lot of people was thinking this badge was just basically for when you literally coming down the court. Nah, bro, this actually helps you when you, you know what I mean, when you dribbling and not even coming down the court. People don't know about that, man. So make sure you go ahead and equip that, bro. If you ask me, it makes my player more hyper. You feel what I'm saying? It makes my player hyper, bro. We hype. You know what I mean? So now the next badge I'm going to show y'all is this quick chain badge. Now, this is one of the most important badges out of all playmaking badges, man. A lot of people sleep on this. Quick chain is definitely the badge to go with, bro, because this actually helps you chain your combos way more faster now if i had this on bron if i had this on silver it'd be a little bit more slower than than what it is you feel what i'm saying i'll be out there dribbling like a turtle you feel what i'm saying so this is a really really important badge man make sure i got this and if y'all don't get this quick chain badge then you still can dribble and do the things that i'm doing you just not gonna be as fast as me you feel what i'm saying so make sure i got that quick chain badge bro it's important bro now the next badge i'm gonna show y'all man is the quick first step man you want this on max you want this on max bro just because you want to be fast you feel what i'm saying you want to be fast at all times so you can get a bucket you feel what i'm saying now not only that man this is another important badge man handles for days man if you don't want to go out there and you you don't want to get tired while you dribbling bro you need this handles for days bro really important badge man and now the, those are only the badges that is really important for this dribble tutorial man uh all my other badges i use for other things like you know you got to have unpluckable that's a must have you feel what i'm saying now for me i rock with the quick stop bro because i be doing a lot of quick stops so you need this badge to do quick stop i got a quick stop video coming soon make sure y'all stay tuned you feel what i'm saying and then boom that leaves me with one badge <laughs> And that's it, man. So that's all the badges. So now we finna get into the tutorial, man. All right, man. Now I'm finna show y'all how to use and activate all the moves, man, real quick, man. Uh, we're gonna start off with something simple, man. Now I'm gonna show y'all if y'all equip the, the uh, Trey Young or you either got the Dwayne Wade, then I'm gonna show y'all how to use those and activate those real quick. So I use the Trey Young. So in order to activate this Trey Young, it is really, really simple and easy. All you gotta do is while standing still, my ball in my right hand, I'm gonna flick. I'm going to hold turbo and I'm going to flick the left. Like, I'm going to still hold it right now. Like, I'm going to hold turbo. Then I'm going to flick the right analog stick diagonally up left because the ball is in my right hand. So, as soon as I flick the right stick diagonally up left, it's, it's going to give me this. And now, this move is really, really deadly. Like I said, vice versa. I'm going to hold turbo, flick it up diagonally right by my left you feel what i'm saying it's real easy this move is really 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 dangerous because you can speed boost out of it now i'm gonna show y'all real quick how to speed boost out of it hold r2 flick it diagonally up right because the ball in the left hand and then you want to move your left stick to the left while still holding turbo so now you get like this running animation and you can spam it now all of this dribbling stuff bro really is just all about angles bro now y'all see if i don't take the right angle he gonna get this little animation right here you know what i'm saying when he's not just not running so fast so it's all about angles bruh but if you get the angles bruh then you can be able to just spam this move now that's one simple move that i showed y'all real quick now the next thing i'm gonna show y'all is this dwayne wade and how to activate this save the ball in your left hand it's best to know what ball handling your hand is is, is in because you know what i mean you just want to know so you you know what i mean can combo up you feel what i'm saying so make sure you get in the lab and you practice this bro if you really want to get good at dribbling and you want to just get you a bucket make sure you practice so in order to activate this move man it's really really simple all you got to do is while you're standing still is hold flick the right analog stick up it was called the rhythm dribble last year but this is the animation you get now out of this animation uh you can't you know speed boost out of it you just kind of gotta you know what i mean you gotta time it everything is all about timing you feel what i'm saying so you just gotta time it so you flick it up as soon as you see it get all the way down there you feel what i'm saying and you take off with it this is why i like it so much too and then this little move that you get is clean i'm telling you i stand still activate this ankle breaker just like that ankle breaker boom and then shot you feel what i'm saying this is this is how i be getting my buckets bro um but now i'm gonna show y'all another move real quick now i'm gonna show y'all how to activate uh this move and behind the back a lot of people don't really know how to do this but i'm gonna just show y'all real quick man so while you running down the court you're gonna have your left stick flicking up and then you're gonna flick your uh right analog stick diagonally down right because your ball in your left hand you feel what i'm saying so you're going forward the whole time and you flick it down you feel what i'm saying so that's a little something easy now i'm gonna show y'all how to do the standing behind the back man so while you're standing still you gotta hold 
turbo for like a split second but you want to almost like hold it still because you gotta once you do the behind the back obviously you want to be able to speed boost out of it so you want to hold turbo and then you want to flick your right analog stick diagonally down left now y'all see the ball is in my right hand now i want y'all to pay attention to that i'm gonna flick the the right analog stick diagonally down left because i want to switch it to my other hand and it's going to do it behind the back while i'm standing but then when i flick it diagonally down left i'm gonna go left with my left stick now it's crazy it's crazy as that sound bro this year they making us dribble where you have to use your left stick to point toward wherever you want to go okay so like i said the ball in the right hand we're gonna hold turbo and we're gonna flick diagonally down left and then go left boom all in one moment sometimes you do get this this little behind the back what happens when you get this behind the back is you're not using your left stick to make you burst out that way you see what i'm saying so you can still do this right here this is one move that still be getting kills too bro just to flick it but when you flick it all the way with your left stick you get this now you can spam this move oh my god you get this down pack then you good and it's vice versa and it's all about just knowing what ball hand you, you know what I'm saying? What 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 hand your ball in? You know what I mean? So once y'all get that, y'all should be good. Now, the next thing I'm going to show y'all real quick. Like I said, I like these cigs. And this is what I've been killing with for so much. Like, say if you want to just stand still, right? And you want to just dribble. This is this is, this is is what I got for y'all. You feel what I'm saying? This right here. You know, y'all, if y'all don't know about this, man, then, oh, oh my God. Y'all, it'd be a lot of people at the park doing it. It's like a little, it's like a little cross. In order to do this move, all you got to do is just knowing what ball handling it is so i'm gonna start off by flicking it right and then left right so look right left right left but if you catch it and like press turbo catch it and then go that way with your left stick it'll give you that little crossover but like i said it gets more smoother bro the more you practice and you get it down packed you feel what i'm saying and it's still all about the angles and using your left stick man so hopefully that's not too much but now we're gonna move on to some of the advanced dribbling moves so i'm gonna show y'all how to do a momentum man so check this out in order to do a momentum bro it's really easy it's kind of like how we did the trey young but the whole time you're holding turbo so the ball is in my left hand and, and i want to do a momentum to the right right so i'm gonna flick the right analog stick diagonally up right while holding turbo the whole time and i'm gonna flick my left stick to go right okay so boom now you can spam this and it's really it's really hard to spam it but at the same time you know what i mean that's how that's how you get it done you know what i mean like i said it's, uh, it's all about timing and angles on this game bro so as soon as y'all master that bro y'all should y'all gonna be good but, you know what i mean i can only spam two right now i can't do the whole thing i ain't gonna even clap <laughs> But anyways man so so that's what i showed y'all real quick now y'all got this trey young you know what i mean mixing your moves now i'm gonna show y'all this move real quick man now this move is really simple and easy it don't matter what six you got on you can do this move at any given time with any six this is a really good move that i use a lot of the times just to break my defender down and in order to do this move all you want to do is, is you want to hold you want to flick your right analog stick up first and then flick your left stick down right after you flick your right stick up okay so hopefully that makes sense for y'all but it's all in one motion and it's kind of like you got to make sure your player is square like you can't hit it over here you got to like slow down slow down like if you if you familiar with doing like quick stars then you got to kind of slow down you know what i mean slow down catch it and then you can't speed boost out of it because you know what i'm saying like i said with that left stick you gotta you gotta you know what i mean you gotta pick where you want to go so the left stick is super super duper important bro i'm telling you bro but it's this this move right here is gonna take y'all a long time to learn probably because i ain't gonna lie it took me a minute to learn but once you learn how to do it oh my god man see that's why y'all gotta get in the lab bro y'all gotta get in the lab bro i'm telling y'all like it's uh, it's crazy so now i just showed y'all a couple of moves man so y'all could just mix in what y'all want to mix in you know what i mean do y'all thing and then now i'm gonna show y'all this move and spin man this is the last thing i'm gonna show y'all in order to do this move and spin it's really simple say if you're running to the right you're gonna go from three o'clock to six o'clock bro okay so you're gonna go from three o'clock to six o'clock when you run it to the left to the right you want to let go everything and then just go from three to three o'clock to six o'clock with your uh right analog stick so you run to the right boom you feel what I'm saying? I love that move because, you know what I mean? They think you finna drive, but you not finna drive. You finna spark it. You know what I mean? Especially if you do it out of like a Trey Young speed boost. And then you, uh, you know what I mean? 
Really, really, really good move, man. So just make sure y'all get in the lab and y'all practice, man. I'm telling y'all, y'all be going crazy. Guy kind of messed up right there, but hey, I'm telling you, these these things is crazy, bro. So make sure y'all cop, man. Hopefully, I helped y'all out, man. If you made it this far in the video, man, say so real gang in the chat, man. Y'all know I'm always coming with bangers, man. But anyways, that's the end of the video, man. I got more videos dropping, so make sure you hit that subscribe button, man. And I'm going to see y'all in the next video, okay?